So, dude, I got this. I got this massage gun. You know. Okay. Oh. My, <laughs> <laughs> gotta crank it up, you know. <laughs> been exercising. Oh, yeah, I got a <laughs> sore shoulders. You know, I'm an old man. Dang. Oh, oh yeah, I gotta get in there real good. Uh, uh. <laughs> I'm jelly. <laughs> this thing's awesome. Heck yeah, it's a hand. It's a hand. It's pretty much a gun, and it's got a <laughs> ball on the end of it, and then just crank it up and stick it, stick it places. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be sore from all the massages. <laughs> <laughs> I've, been, I've been trying to, I've been trying to like slowly get back into exercising, right? And so I'm doing simple workouts, but the pain's lingering. Mm. Like I told, I told you about like doing push-ups that one time, and how I stayed sore for like forever. Yeah. Got back down the floor yesterday, hit like three of them, and like I don't know, like whatever those muscles are over your ribs, whew, it's still hurting. <laughs> and it's been it's been like a week. <laughs> wow! <laughs> but now my shoulders pulled. <laughs> Jeez! <laughs> Some dumbbells. I was like I was like curling into like a shoulder press, okay. and I guess I just like rotate it weird when I went up. And yeah, wow. Being old is fun. <laughs> uh, but another fun thing. Uh, well, I shouldn't say that. It's not fun to me. But to some people, is taking their kids to pageants in America. We're watching the crazy pageant mom. She buys daughters 12 dresses for one pageant. Toddlers and tiaras. It's been a long time since we did have toddlers and tiaras. Um, pretty much my whole... Like, God, we were still on like the couch back then, too, the last time we did this. Oh, wow. It's been a hot minute then. Yeah, my whole take was that... It's like a, a weird form of child abuse, in my opinion. Like just making your kids, like go to these pageants and stuff. It's not for the kids. It's for the parents, right? Yeah, definitely for the parents. Uh, like I don't even think, like ch- child pageants. I don't even think that's like a thing outside of America. Maybe it is. Maybe I'm wrong. But just from my little knowledge about it, I don't even think they they allow that. They don't like allow like creepy old dudes to go like judge how cute your kid is. I mean. Chris Hansen will walk in the room if oh. that's going on. <laughs> yeah, now when you when you word it like that, it's kind of really weird. Well, I feel like every time you you watch the shows or even on like movies where they're doing it, there's always like that one guy that's a judge. I don't know mm. why. Why is he there? Right. Anyway, we're gonna watch, we're gonna watch that. But first of that, look at the look at the look at the graph, man. Look at this graph. <laughs> Best, best graph ever, and that's thanks to you because you subscribed and you watch the videos. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe because it makes my graph look better and you'll enjoy the videos. You can also check out Dane at Buff Pro on Buff Pro on YouTube and Twitch. And yeah, let's watch this junk. Let's do it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm Cheyenne, and I'm eight. <laughs> All right, Cheyenne, age eight. What are you, what's going on here? <laughs> what are they doing <laughs> under the rug? Oh, Communing. Nice. Having to relax a little bit, a little woosa. <laughs> woosa. <laughs> when I meditate, I win. I am Trisma, and my eight year old daughter, Cheyenne, is dynamite. Trisma? Yeah. Grand yeah, Trisma? I played that game. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say, we did uh, Trisma Plus, didn't we? D and D rolled them dice. So she's there meditating, and she's envisioning herself winning. Ah. And her mom's over there like, yeah, yeah, tell me when they give you that crown, girl. Tell me when you're getting crowned and when the crowning is done. Tell me when they do it. <laughs> oh, they got she the medals crazy. up here and everything. Right, she just got There's... a football trophy. She's so good. <laughs> She's like Heisman. <laughs> Cheyenne and I meditate before pageants, and we come into our alter ego. I need energy, and I want some more smiling oh, and some more balance. I just want you to be... Oh, okay. okay. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, mom. This, this is about me, not you. All right, come on, mom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, but let me live. Let me live through you. Come on, please, daughter. Please. I don't think that any of the pageant moms are crazy. Oh, of course she doesn't. Because <laughs> she's a pageant mom. Right. <laughs> I'm not crazy. I promise. Okay. <laughs> I'm not crazy. I was going to say, nobody said you was until I, you know, that I remember the title. They literally call her a crazy pageant mom. <laughs> That's true. I think we should call it passionate pageant moms. There you go. PPM. PPM. My passionate. mom is a crazy pageant mom. <laughs> daughter says well, she's crazy. Might, so. Yeah. There you go. That, that yeah, gave it away. Wait, wait, who's Who is this? Whose hand is over here holding oh, these leaves? Oh my gosh. What? There's just someone standing in the yard holding some leaves. Like, <laughs> 
Ah, yes. I was just borrowing these. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, man. Let me put your leaf back. Uh... They were trying to get a cool scene where like the leaves are falling. It's like, okay, just throw them in the air when we come outside. Like, All right. And they just cut it. There's just another person <laughs> holding the rest of the flowers up, too. There's actually no flowers there. <laughs> yeah, they're holding for the camera. Yeah. Oh, wait, <laughs> What are these? Are these flowers? They're all dead. <laughs> I guess someone's getting ready to leave, too, because they got all the suitcases out here. Like, the daughter's like, all right, after this episode, I'm gone, Mom. I'm out. <laughs> Check your mail. Yeah. Run. Run. Job, job. We do to get ready for pageants. And we run. We exercise. We watch what we eat. Like, Mom, you're throwing around a whole lot of wheeze in there. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> uh, we do that. Together. <laughs> Hurry up! Yeah. You're slowing us down! Wait. They have to be in good shape in order to do talent. Relax. Uh, this is what I call training for pageant. <laughs> oh my god. Jeez. She's eight years old. <laughs> Jeez. She's eight years old. What do you mean? What are you doing? Mom's out there doing like the shoulder exercises while she's walking with her five pound weights. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> What a workout. Yeah, putting a 40-pound vest on her kid. Like, oh, There was a, uh, a, a friend of mine, he's a physical therapist, and he was, t he was talking about how, like, you know that stretch where you bend over and touch your toes? Yeah. He hit me with some big brain stuff. He was like, dude, I hate that stretch. He, like, puts all this, you know, extra stress in your lower back, and you don't need to. Uh, he works with a lot, of, a lot of older people, so he's like, this is what you do. You just, you just stand straight, kind of like, and, like, you gotta stick your like stick your chest out, stick your butt out just a little bit, like get everything just straight, and then just lean forward. Here, I'll show you. Just he's like he's like <laughs> like just hit this move right here. Stand up, you get it? Keep okay. Everything straight and just lean forward, like lean your chest forward. He's like yeah. you don't have to go for you don't have to go very far, and you feel it. You don't gotta bend over or anything. You just you, huh. you just pretty much just lean forward a little bit, and you get the, like the same stretch. Wow. He's like that looks way not as cool. But <laughs> thank you for telling me as you, you know, treat your elderly patients yeah. <laughs> to me, <laughs> I will definitely use it. And it's, it's, it's good. Like, I guess like wow. it doesn't like, you know, like stretch your lower back very much. But, I mean, I don't know, but it gets like the whole thing. Okay. I was going to say, cause my, my stomach's in the way anyway, you know? So like I couldn't yeah. touch my toes anyway. So, you know, I'm, I'm all about that one. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> old man stretches heck yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because i'm i'm like the i gotta be like the least stretchable limber dude on the planet like i haven't been able to touch my toes even when i was skinny Bro. like i just just don't happen yeah i'm like stiff as a board dude like <laughs> literally i like put my legs out in front of me you know i'm sitting down amber's like all right lean forward and touch your toes i'm like wait i I am. What do you mean? <laughs> yeah. Like I am literally. <laughs> you sit on the floor and like just you sitting on the floor is already a stretch. <laughs> it's like yep. I can't go further anymore. I'm leaning back because it's too much. <laughs> oh, God. I, I know it. I, I know. I feel you. I know what you mean. <laughs> I actually bought twelve dresses um, because I didn't know which one I wanted Cheyenne to wear. Shammy, Shammy, Shammy. I'm like, why are you getting all this stuff? <laughs> <laughs> like, man why she's she's playing though you know she's like oh my god look at all these dresses this is awesome right i'm gonna be playing princess for forever <laughs> oh my goodness yeah. been, this is very pretty dress is that a cat is it that gotta be a toy it can't be a real cat i don't know actually what, what is this what is this that they have covered up by the dresses like this is the biggest trophy right here it's it hidden stretches all the way up comes out the neck hole up there you see that and <laughs> <laughs> and another thing why do they have so many suitcases there's suitcases here too there's suitcases in the front porch there's suitcases in here this family on the run yeah they might be they're the freaking pageant bandits <laughs> they go and they rob the other kids of the win <laughs> they and then they rob trophies. to the next pageant <laughs> that's why they had the football trophy because it's when they snatched it and ran <laughs> this doorstop looks crazy too Overall, I spent on her dresses alone. Oh, oh, quick maps. Oh, quick maps. I spent about eleven thousand five hundred dollars. Oh, what? Um, on those dresses? Like those are like the ten dollar dresses you get from the toy store, right? <laughs> I don't trust her math. I seen those down at Foreman Mills. <laughs> <laughs> she got <out> of Foreman Mills. <laughs> 
<laughs> maybe 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 she means like dresses like in total, total over yeah. like I don't know the well the kid's only eight. I mean, nah, yeah. Yeah. What age do you start that? Uh, over a five year mm-hmm. period. That's a lot. That's a lot of money on dresses, though. Yeah, it mm-hmm. is. And and she just goes and buys like however many twelve dresses just for this this occasion. <laughs> oh God. That's why they got the bags packed because she got, she got it on credit. <laughs> True, right? You don't know where to send that bill. <laughs> but everything is for you. I was actually supposed to be paying for a new fence, oh, and God. I used the money for her dresses. Oh. Jeez, get, get a fence. Oh, my no. God, someone's going to die on that. That's like the thing that you that you fall into in the horror movie and die. You know? <laughs> yeah. You're like That's running away and you're doing good. Yeah. <laughs> you uppercut it and you like stick to it. <laughs> and the mom's like, this is for you. This is for you. Whatever, mom. Right. This is, this is, this is for you. He always come out those little holes. I believe that it's better to enjoy money than just stare at it. And putting the fence up would have been just staring at money. This logic is bad. <laughs> Okay. Girl's like, I want our, I want our fence fixed so our dog will stop running away. And mom's like, Nah, we're just gonna stare at it, just like we're gonna stare at these dresses. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What are you doing with the dress when you're not staring at it? She's wearing them. It's different. It's different. She'll win awards. Then we'll stare at the trophies, I guess. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, Eventually, something's getting stared at. But those dresses, they dance every time Cheyenne walks. If I win money, I will spend my money on the gate. What a ni- what a nice little girl! Oh my gosh! Stepping up, her mom's over buying twelve dresses <laughs> so she can pick one and return the other ones and fix your gate. Right? God dang! Oh, they're getting their nails done now. No, because she's so young, we highly don't recommend because that's may damage her nail. <laughs> Ooh, they're mad! They're not happy with that answer. Maybe we may have to make some sacrifices, you know, to make her nails longer. Don't worry about our safety. It wouldn't be good if mommy would do something that would destroy your nails. Can I have a kiss? You're good. Oh. She slowly wow. slipped. No, you can't have a kiss. I wanted tips. <laughs> They'll hurt you. I don't comprehend that. <laughs> right. <laughs> I only want what I want. I'm a child. Holy slipping into diva land. I'm sorry. <laughs> I wonder why she's slipping into diva land. I wonder, oh, I wonder what happened. Oh, she got her nails done and cried about it. Oh, the rewards of parenting. Excuse me. Can you please put the tips on her now? Wow. Uh, can you just put the tips on? All right. Like, like, no, it'll hurt. It'll damage her. Maybe it may hurt her. Now put them on. She's sad. Give her what she wants. She knows what she wants. Her happiness is first. Oh, That's said, all okay. that matters in life. I know that her being sad would have did more damage in the long run. No, oh, you know, she, she said what? that she didn't want to do the... I don't know why they got the sander out all of a sudden. <laughs> she said she didn't want to do the pageant. Mom was like, mm, so the tips, that's the problem. Right, Give her the tips. Right. Oh, you big sad. Pageant. You don't want to do the pageant. All right. Yeah, parent manipulation 101 right there. Yeah. yeah. Oh, they're sad. They don't want to do anything. Give them what they want. Make them happy, and they'll do what I want them to do now. <laughs> her spirit would have been stepped on, and I don't want her spirit at all to ever be hindered for any reason at all. You don't want her spirit to be hindered. She uh, wants your gate fix or a dog or something running away. Right. That's what your daughter's going to use with her money. <laughs> it's only right that I do my part and make sure she has what she needs. But she's still crying about You're it. You're the winner. Come on. Now. But she's still sad. Right. What? <laughs> Maybe they hurt her. I don't know. <laughs> grinded them off. All right. Here we are. These are the, are these are this the judges panel. Well, here's the here's the the one dude. You right. Know, now the hairline going straight to space. <laughs> <drinking a> Snapple. <laughs> I got Garth. <laughs> I got Garth. <laughs> From Wayne's World, right there. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Our petite division. Please welcome Caitlin. This, all right, look, this is, it's so weird. Why would you dress your little girl up to look like an adult and have people judge her? Like, it's just, I don't know. It is weird. It's so, it's so pageant. That's, that's why we never, we never did any more of these. Like they're so crazy, but it just, I don't know. It always bothered me on like some different level. Uh, and I just, I always hated it. Anyway, that's just 
Let's make fun of this video some more. So the only way I can make it through it. <laughs> she enjoys dancing, gymnastics, and art. <laughs> oh! Oh, now she's gonna cry. Oh, I messed up on stage. Oh no! Yes, it's so oh no! My mom put so much pressure on me that I had one little mistake, and now I th <sighs> oh, everything's crushed. Yay! What a healthy relationship we have. Right, <laughs> yeah, dude. Oh, it's so bad. Oh. You know how to model. You love modeling, right? Just yeah, here we go. The classic. Oh, she doesn't actually want to do it. Okay, let's talk her into it. Come on, come on. Everybody get in here. Hype her up. Make her, her do up. it. I was nervous and I didn't like it. We now continue with number 28, Cheyenne. Cheyenne, the old Diamond Dallas Page over here, the DDP. <laughs> Before. After, I did not see that dress on the wall. That is a good point. <laughs> Where is the wall? Hmm. She must. She must have had to go and buy a whole nother dress because I don't see it up there either. I don't either. Yeah, thirteen. So it's like a vest over one of the dresses. I guess it doesn't look like it's the same quality though. It looks like the <laughs> dress is nicer <laughs> than the one she had hanging on the wall that she paid a thousand dollars a piece for. Before and after. Wow, like, look at the body language. Like, she's <clears throat> she's at home having fun. Yay, this is fun. And then on the right, she's like, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> oh, no. This is uncomfortable. And a lot of energy, and I can't wait to see her again. Cheyenne, number 28. Thank you. <laughs> He's like, what? talking off the stage. Cheyenne, all right, get out of here. Thank you. <laughs> well, it's not really a girdle. What we have on Cheyenne is a shape. We put the shape oh. on so the dress will look perfectly fitting. Hold your foot. Lift your knee. Lift your knee. Lift your what? knee. What? I'm on what? <laughs> I'm on. We're putting a shaper on so the. Oh, I'm on what? I've been practicing sucking in the stomach. Oh, great. <sighs> sweet. Sweet. Eight year, eight year old needs to worry about it. Suck your stomach in. Well, did she win that last one or what? What happened? I what don't the know. Results? Maybe the rounds. Are there rounds? <laughs> Going round two right now? Yeah. <laughs> and suck in that stomach. Go. Diana Ross performing oh, yeah. in her signature dress. Her signature dress. Diane uh. is a gorgeous girl. The parents always say, well, what are the judges looking for? I don't judge a little girl on their figure. I look at the beauty of the child, not at the shape of the child. <laughs> the beauty of the child, not the shape of the child. What, is, what does that mean? What does I don't, that yeah, mean? What, what does that? First off, you're judging you're judging children. <laughs> I'm, I'm judging them on their beauty, their 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 inner beauty. I judge them on who looks the least uncomfortable because that right. says a lot about their personality. I, I don't know. What, what do you mean? You're judging a freaking. Jeez. Uh, I don't know, the that, effort the mom put in. I don't know, man. It's just like, even like just listening to that, like that person's like, oh, you know, they judge them on their inner beauty. You're, you're freaking judging kids' pageant shows. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> just as trash as the parents are. The end of Diva came out. She really did Diana Ross perfectly. Did you have fun? Crowning is on its way. We got what it takes. She had fun in the end. Okay. You know? She's like, yeah, I had fun. Well, I mean, yeah. I mean, I don't know. What? I don't know. As long as the it's, kid is having fun, and that's the purpose of the whole thing. Well, the, sure. I think the question is, would this kid do this for fun on their own? And if True. you get if you get a bunch of adults be like, "Yeah, it was great," of course she's going to get excited and like think it's fun, right? Right. But she didn't look like she was having much fun when she was getting ready. Like, "Ow, mom, ow!" You know, what do you do, <laughs> mom? My dog, my dog ran away through a broken fence. Oh, I'm so sad. <laughs> they have to like talk her to get on the stage, and then she, afterwards she's like, "Oh, it's over. Yeah, that was fun. I'm glad it's over." <laughs> right? Yeah. I uh, oh, hope I win man. so I can pay the rent. You know, I gotta be the responsible. One here. <laughs> Our supreme winner is Cheyenne. Our Supreme I winner. I received the Division Supreme title. I want it more. How did so, they get more than seven people in a division? She didn't get the, the number. Well, what's better than the Supreme Award? I, I The Overlord Award. I don't know. The, <laughs> <laughs> the Grand Master. Master of the Universe. <laughs> yeah. I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Now now there's technicalities. We didn't get the number one award. So <laughs> How, right. who can I complain to to not get anything changed at all and embarrass everybody? 
We were told there were seven contestants per division, but she said it was only going to be seven. I'm kind of upset about that because her odds were lost because there were 14 contestants. Well, did she win or not? Did mom is mad? Right. Look at that. <laughs> that crown. Look at that wad of. Wait. $100? Ding! Whoa! That's almost a piece of a dress. Sure, she can almost. She can get a quote on that fence now. You know? <laughs> <laughs> almost pay for materials, maybe. Nah, nah, she can't. <laughs> she installs it herself. <laughs> She got the best coach. No, listen. She got the best coach. She got the best hair makeup artist. She got the best um, makeup. It was a oh, lot here of mom children. Goes. Hi, yeah. <laughs> is she all those things, or is that her whole team she's talking about? I hope it's the whole team. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> she got the, the best, best mom. She's got the best person that gave birth to her. She's got the best person who lives in her house and gives her <laughs> directions. It's all about her and my baby having fun, but we're the best, okay? Pat yourselves in the back. We did it, y'all. It's, it's definitely not about us at all. I thought there was only going to be seven girls per division. We had a lot of entries into this into this age group. This is always our heaviest age group. I know I'm a crazy pageant mom. I'm going to ask questions. Early, you said you wasn't crazy. And now, you, <laughs> and now you're admitting to it. I'm crazy when I got to be crazy. Right. How dare you let other kids participate? <laughs> That's cheating. Um, I have so much high expectation, and I know my daughter is the bomb. I was just kind of really upset, so I might take a break from pageants right now. That I might be the be... best thing for mom. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Just It's weird that she's upset, so she's going to take a break from pageants, and that means the daughter's not going to go, right? Because mom's taking a break from the pageants. Probably yeah. not if it was actually for the daughter, right? Like if it was for <laughs> Cheyenne. I don't know. Cheyenne she's still gonna still go. I don't going. know. I don't know, man. And they're pageant moms. They freaking cringe to my soul here with the comments. Say the daughter is more responsible than her mother. It's sad that she thinks she needs to spend her mo any money she wins to pay for a fence to keep her doggy safe. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, everyone's like, the damage you're doing to your daughter. We run, we watch, we eat, we exercise. I see the kid doing it. But certainly not the mom. <laughs> she could have gotten pressed nails, not tips. Yeah. Well, TLC, they, they, man, they know what they're doing. Nobody, nobody, nobody would ever watch this show because they want to see, like, they're they're doing their thing and they're all happy. No, people watch the show because they want to see the train wrecks of, like, the parents. Yeah. And that, and that is definitely 100% what's happened. Oh, man. I hope TLC lines them all up for therapy after all of it. Yeah, you know, just don't, don't take your, just take, take your kid out of pageants because you know, it's, the whole thing's just kind of weird. It it's is. really weird. It's real. It it's really weird. Anyway, <laughs> thanks your birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. Uh, leave a comment, do all that kind of cool stuff. Uh, say toast to my friends, and I love you. Kind of creeped me out a little bit whispering to me like that.